What's going on everybody? Welcome back to G Miles World. And right now we're going to be talking about the Madden 23 Ultimate Team dailies are not tracking for a lot of players. And this is getting really, really uh, frustrating for me. Uh, just because I know, like I said, the gameplay of this game is really terrible. And if you can't even enjoy getting the cards that you like, it, it starts to get really, really bad. Like how many of you guys have been mossed into another galaxy by, you know, Harold Carmichael or Calvin? I'm usually the guy doing it, but that's not the point. The point is this, bro. There's a lot going on right now, so I'm going to let you guys know what you should do. Um, there's a couple of ways that uh, we've been able to work around doing it, and I'm going to go through those ways. And then I'm also going to let you guys know more information about getting in contact with EA Sports, not just for the fact of, you know, letting them know that your dealers are not working, but being more in-depth. Because what happens is, a lot of the feedback that most of you guys give, you usually do get somebody that doesn't know what's going on. The only thing that most of the EA help, uh, you know, staff knows is that the field pass is broken, but they don't know specifically what you're missing out on and what's going on. So let's go ahead with step one, okay? I've already done my daily for today, right? So, oh no, I haven't, I haven't. So look, this is what I'm gonna show you. Cause I thought that I did, but this is actually perfect. I did not complete a set yet. So this is actually beautiful. I'm gonna show you in my stats. You can see my daily tracker. We're at eight of 10. A lot of you guys have not been able to track since the first day. Uh, you know, the update that was, um, I think it was 1.006. Let's double check that real quick. Uh, 1.006, that fixed my dailies and my daily start to register. I am on PS5. Some of you guys don't have that same version. Some of you guys have different versions, but that specific version fixed my dailies, all right? This is what happens, right? When you go into the daily section, as you're completing each thing, if you actually go to it and click it and then complete it, it's actually it actually registers efficiently. So let me break this down for you. You know how like usually you'll just go and do the things because it's by muscle memory, your brain already knows what you're supposed to do. You uh, you know record 200 offensive yards, you purchase a pack and you complete a set. Well, if you do that without going to the screen, sometimes it won't register. So let me show you what happens. Say I didn't purchase a pack. I would come over here once it resets and I would go and click the button. Like I would actually click this segment, pressing the X button, or if you're on Xbox, press the A button, right? And then it'll take you into the store to purchase a pack. After you purchase the pack, you would back out and then it would show you that it registered, right? You do the same thing for all three. And then what happens is when you do the last one, like watch this, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna complete, you know, just a regular random set, whichever one um, is the easiest one to do. Let me just find maybe like a core elite and we're gonna go ahead and do that. Where What do we have going on right now? Just find something stupid that we could use. Any of these, I usually do um, uniforms, uh, stuff like that. Be careful though with some of the yellow cards because the kickers and the punters are going for like 150K. So if you have gold kickers or gold punters, you should be selling them, not doing this, um, you know, what I'm about to do right now. All right, so right here, a 72 to 73, right? We're gonna go ahead and redeem these. These are core goals. I don't, hold on, wait a minute. No, 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 hold on, hold on, dude. Hold on, I gotta make sure those are not punters. Hold on, hold on. Cause you could actually press the button and see what's there. What do we got? Le left outside linebacker. This dude sucks. He's a tight end. All right, he's a possession tight end. All right, we're good. So these guys are useless, bro. All right, so we'll go ahead and complete the set, right? Now, after completing this set, you see like how things pop up because we just did that? It automatically pretty much registers it. So when you back out of it, it should take you back to that screen because it, you know, what happens is because it, what that, what, what was that right there? Because it actually, you see like how it brought me back directly to the screen? So now that that happened, when you go back over to the stats, you see like how it shows it like this? Just notice what I'm trying to explain. When you go to the daily thing, I'm still at eight of 10, although I just completed today's, but then I go to this, I go over to the, um, the daily and you saw like how right here at Ultimate Team, it shows it like that. When you go here, right, and you click it, what happens is it takes you to something random like a challenge like whatever this is. You don't have to do anything in this challenge. Wherever it takes you, it doesn't matter. You just back out from it, right? Then when you back out from it, you come back, you see like how it's full? Now, when you go back over to the stats and you look at the uh, daily tracker, it'll still show eight of 10. Then you click this, right? After you click that, it's gonna do the same thing. It's gonna take you to something else that's random like the challenges or whatever. Then when you back out of that part, it should then go to nine of 10. All right, this worked for me before I got that update. And some of you guys were saying, yo, gee, how was your thing tracking before you got the update? 
That's how I was doing it. It is tedious, it's stupid. I don't know why this company, a multi-billion dollar company can't get it right, but I don't want you guys having to go through the fact of not being able to get these dailies because if you don't get these dailies and you weren't fortunate enough to get the glitch that made people just gain XP levels, it's gonna take you forever to get Josh Allen. All right, so after you go back there, now you see that it's nine of 10. Once you leave the screen, you should also receive your daily coin pack, right? Once you back out of all of that, okay, you'll see everything registers and you should be able to get a daily coin pack. If you've done this correctly, if you've done everything that I said correctly in those steps, you will get, it, it will, it should register. It should, all right? But this is just the first step of it. Now, if for whatever reason there's an issue and it's still not working, oh my goodness, dear Lord, thank you, thank you, EA Sports. If for whatever reason it's still not working for you, and it's like, yo, gee, my dailies are still not tracking. This is where now you have to actually deal with the EA Sports and their bots. And sometimes you'll get lucky enough to get a human. All right. So this is what you're going to do. Your uh, PSN or your Xbox ID is directly linked to everything that goes on with the MUT, you know, the MUT server. So what you're going to have to explain is exactly what's going on. Because this is how you know you're going to have a bot or not. When you tell them what's, you know, like specifically the daily tracker in my game is not registering my daily objectives, right? If they don't give you a response other than, oh, I'm sorry about that, how can I help you? If that happens, you're dealing with a bot. But what happens is if you keep going specific, they're gonna, you know, eventually you'll get to somebody that's real. And that's what's helped a lot of my other viewers to get their dailies to track, okay? You're going to tell them, okay, look, listen up here, guys. I'm not getting my daily objectives completed for the daily tracker, okay? And what's happening is, I'm losing out on my cards through the field pass. That's the words verbatim you have to use in order for them to know exactly what you're doing. Because like I said, if you don't get those dailies, it's no way possible you're getting towards Josh Allen. Now we're gonna go ahead and break it down for you. You're gonna have to go ahead and you're gonna have to contact at EA Help on Twitter, all right? What I'm gonna do is, I, I probably could put a graphic on the video. Would you guys like to see it visibly? Like, because some of you guys will be like, yo, gee, what is that, what is that contact again? What's going, I'm gonna try to put it on, on the video. At EA Help on Twitter, okay? With that, you're going to open up a claim. They're going to DM you. Make sure it's the verified account on Twitter. Also on Facebook, if you follow me on Facebook, at G Myers World, right? And you look at help.ea.com, there's a lot of posts with people that have been, I've been helping people like to get into contact with EA. Help.ea.com, you can formally get a ticket number for your claim about your missing XP and the fact that it's not working. Because what happens is all of those tickets, it goes, they have to account for them. So the more of you that complain about your dailies, EA will have no choice but to actually make sure it's fixed. I do believe by next week, everybody else should be having it because like I said, I've been on this all, all the time. You guys know that. Although mine have been tracking, I don't care. I go hard like mine ain't tracking because you guys that support me and watch my videos, I want you guys to go through the same hell as me and get moss in the game. So I want you to actually play the game and I want you to take advantage of this. So those are the two sites. I'm going to put it in the video so that it helps you out at, e, at EA Help on Twitter and also help.ea.com. Specifically tell them what I told you in this video. My daily tracker is not registering in my field pass and they're either gonna give you like free packs to kind of cool you down and then you may end up getting just random XP because I think that that's what they're gonna have to do for a lot of you guys that have not been getting the dailies because I'm not gonna stop doing this until all of you guys are getting your dailies tracked correctly. I wanna thank you guys and girls for watching. You have a beautiful day. Until next time, one love, y'all.